The FMSC food really is the fuel for everything that happens in our child development model. Without a meal, there's no education. There's no economic empowerment. To us, feeding a kid is the beginning of really having an impact in a community, in a family, and in a country. The food each month is so vitally important. If we did not receive the food each month and feed my starving children, people would literally starve to death, and especially the children. The partnership that we have is literally saving people. In our daily programs, our community transformation, the 90 kindergartens that we run, that food is just an essential piece. Feed the Hungry is able to serve in excess of 12,000 kids every day, Congolese refugees that are in school and are hearing the gospel and getting basic foundational needs met because of the partnership with FMSC. There's 426 schools and orphanages that we get to serve because of FMSC. These are kids that otherwise wouldn't be in school. These are kids that otherwise probably wouldn't be eating much at all. Well, we say empty bed cannot stand. So if, uh, if the person is hungry, how can you even talk to them when they, they can't even pay attention? If you were starving, your children were starving, all you would think about is where can I get a little bit of rice for my children? That's all you think about. And to be able to give them the Feed My Starving food that is with the nutritional things that are in it, 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 it saves lives because they're able to easily digest it and be able to bring their health up and their digestive system up where they can become a healthy person. Without that food, in many cases, children would die. So then that, that food really helps take them into the development aspect and allows them to be able to get those skills, to get that education, so that they can be able to go out and get a job or start that business and do those things that allow them to be economically self-sufficient. It's really the entry point, and I know that the, the stabilization part of knowing that you have those meals coming from Feed My Starving Children and the allocation that they give you every year helps you know that you're gonna be there not just for the short term, but also for the long term. So getting all that food from uh, Feed My Starving Children allows us to do maybe two or three times as much as we would normally do. If we didn't have a partner like Feed My Starving Children, uh, I could honestly say we probably couldn't do 70% um, of what we do. To know that we can have that uh, piece of our budget, the nutrition side, taken care of because of FMSC, frees up resources to do other things. So we're able to drill water wells, provide libraries, provide medical supplies and medical instruments to be able to save lives both physically and spiritually. So without the help and the food from Feed My Starving Children, uh, we couldn't do the other things that we're doing that make a tremendous difference in helping us to reach the world for Christ. The looks on the faces of the children, the looks on the faces of the moms who may not have the food to be able to give to their children every day. It's incredibly priceless. And for volunteers to be coming through the door on a daily basis, they're saving lives. Without you, we couldn't do what we are called to do, which is really serve the poorest of the poor. So please give generously uh, to feed my starving children, get out there and pack and, and really do your bit to, to bless those people in the world who are less fortunate. Realmente estarían muy agradecidos con ustedes como lo están con Dios porque a través de ustedes se están ayudando a alimentar muchos niños en todo el mundo. I'm picturing our, like our orphan kids dancing. They'd be incredibly thankful. They'd sit here and say, you guys fill our bellies. Thank you. God will bless you for what you're doing and keep it up. A lot of the kids would say thank you for life. That package of food to them represents life. The people who have done the packing, the people, the donors who have given money to make sure that the food has come, we say thanks so much. Rest assured, we'll continue doing this work as long as you are with us, ministering, and actually is the ministering the word of God through giving. So God bless you.